Uh, next week, sometime. I'm finishing the plans now. All right. Good morning, everybody. Oh, good question. So we are in the middle of tomorrow's daf, I think. Right, we're in the middle of tomorrow's daf, which is Friday, and hopefully we'll get through most of Shabbos's daf today, and then right a little bit ahead. Um, so we are on. You said Lamed. Yeah, Lamed of an Aleph. So we were discussing uh, Rabbi Nechunia, who said that um, oh, just like by Shabbos, we say when <laughs> one is Chai Benafsho, he's Chai Misa, he's is based in. And then he, and therefore, if you'd be obligated for some sort of payment, right? So Tashlum, he's so, part from that. Sure. So to Kares works the same. He means by Yom Kippur. So he wanted to bring a, a proof. So he brought from the from the pasuk by Ason Ason, and, <coughs> and over there it was a misa day that Yaakov Avinu warned by, about the misa day Shemayim. Don't go down because he might die from from heaven. He might be struck down. So we see over there that Ason refers to so the, in other words of the same category, Lama um, uh, Aleph. So the same category. So the Gemara says we are now, you know. Uh, looks like I don't know seven lines or so from the bottom. And Lama Amar Aleph, second last word. But seen him pachim b'dei shemai minhu, and this be you know one he gets afflicted by by cold or hot you know on the road and he, he succumbs to that. That's b'dei shemai minhu. Baksiv, I we learn in Bryce so the pasuk says the famous the Tanya. The, Tanya. What did I say? Oh yeah. Because we didn't say in a way we go. Oh, Vatanya. Okay, the next part is the I was, I was actually looking for the Pusuk and then I, it didn't make sense because the Pusuk I knew wasn't from Bracious. It was, yeah. So, everything, you know, it's all different types of punishments and stuff are sent down from the heavens except for Tzinu and Pachim. Shinamar, we didn't say the Chsif, right? As the, as, the, as the famous Pusuk in Mishle says, Tzinu and Pachim, but there, Achike, Shemir, Nafsha, Yerachik, Mehem. So it says over there, by the cold and hot, one should distance himself. In other words, a man controls that. He's in charge of that. It's not heavenly sent. It's from him. And furthermore, I have done the day And if one is attacked by lions or, or, or thieves, right, and he's killed by them, he's uh, that that's the day Adam. He was taught that in the day of the basin the was destroyed, and there's no more Sanhedrin. Even though there's no more Sanhedrin. Even though there's no Sanhedrin. Arba Misa is Lebatla. The four Mises based in were not nullified. The Lord says, Lebatla, how about What do you mean they don't want to nullify? They're, they're, they're no longer putting people to death. Ella, rather, what does it mean? It's a din. Arba Misa is Lebatla. Right? Rather, the din, if one person is high for one of the Arba Mises based in, it's not nullified. It's not Lebatla. Misha is high of Skila. So, a person is high of Skila, right? So, Skila, the person is stoned or he's, he's pushed off a, a ledge and the, the rocks are thrown upon him. Right? So even though he doesn't go to court, right? And he does not sentence, and the Basin goes ahead and executes him, right? In their way of skila. Rather, he'll somehow he'll fall from a building, or an animal will go ahead and, and tear him apart. Or Mishnah is chayv straight, a person is chayv straight, but oh no, he'll fall in a fire, or he'll die by a venomous snake. Yeah, I don't know if there were witnesses in Hasra. So, no. Because they, they, there's no Hasra, the Basin doesn't go ahead and, and brings him to but if he's it's really, you know, it, it, perhaps well, if he was, he perhaps if he was right. warned, right? Now, obviously, there's no interrogation of witnesses, you know, because there's no Bayesden around or Sanhedrin around. Uh, that, that, that it, it, if Bayesden was, was around, so it must have been that he probably had to have, that, you know, should have had the proper warning, right? Oh, no, I would like, oh, no, for Machisha. Oh, Mishnah's Chai for Riga. A person's Chai for Hariga, right? The till with the sword, right? Uh, so, oh, uh, Nimsel Machos, at least him, right? He's given over to, to the kingdom and they'll execute him, but behead him, or, 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 or other, you know, thugs. And by, uh, or at least him by the law, for Mishnah's Chayv Chayv, a person's Chayv to the strangulation, or to the Benor, or the Sarnachi, right? Either he'll, he'll, he'll go ahead and he'll drown, right? Or he'll, he'll die with some sort of uh, uh, disease that his throat will close up. So you see mm. that an, an animal attacking you is not, uh, or, or, or thieves attacking you is not something which is b'day adam. That's b'day shemayim. So Ella, you put rather switch it around. I'm going to be b'day shemayim. Rather, if he was the no, the the the, the asson is that if he's attacked by lions or gonavim, that's b'day shemayim. And sinapachim is b'day adam. That's the person in control because then 
he, you know, he dresses appropriately or prepares uh, properly for the weather. Fine. So that was just an explanation, a uh, uh, finish of the explanation of us on us. Now, Rabbi says, Tamad Rabbi Nechunia ben Hikina mehacha. The reason for Rabbi Nechunia ben Hikina is from here. And that was the reason why he holds that the king labeled Rabbi Ne, just like Shabbos, which is Chayv Mises based in, and if one simultaneously is obligated to pay money, he's put there from paying. So too, Kares works the same way that he'd be Chayv Kares and he'd be put there from any sort of payment. We already know that from Mehacha. The Pasuk says, so it says over there, and basically a person gives his his, his child to Moilech, right, for a verse to Chavim, for, for idol worship. So he that person is Chai of Misa, he's basing at the people go ahead and they ignore that, right? They they don't go ahead and prosecute a person since the Moloch. They themselves, right, are are are, are deserving of kares. So, so I'm a Torah kares shali kimisa shalachem. So basically, Torah is equating my kares is like your misa. In other words, I want you to go ahead and put him misa uh, based in. And if you don't do that, I'll give you kares. So misa based is sort of equating the two. So ma misa shalachem put him in the Just like in the case of a person that violates something, which is high misa in the base, and he's potter in the shulman, a potter paying because you pay the more severe punishment. Af kares. So too is one is high kares shuli potter in the shulman. So too, if one is high kares, simultaneously is a time where he's obligated to pay some money for damages. He's potter from paying the damages. So ma'ika ben rabba lebaye. What's the difference between rabba and abaye? So rabba, we just saw rabba learned the, this uh, this kares. Right, uh, he learned the kares from uh, from uh, this case that one is part of kares. And earlier we learned, or yesterday we learned ason ason, right, to say that misa uh, shemayim, one is part of from So what's an afdamina? So zar shaachal truma, right? A non kohen needs truma. So what is the punishment for that? That is misa b'dei shemayim, right? That's not kares, but it is a heavenly sent. Uh, it's, it's a heavenly misa. So the Baye, Pater, according to Baye, he's Pater, because according to Baye yesterday, anything with a Shemayim is learned from us and us and don't go down or us and will happen. Any Misa with a Shemayim, you'd be Pater from Tashlumen. It's the same as an us of Misa's based in, as we learned from the other past, like, right? If he hits a you know, pregnant woman, there is no us on, right? Then he's then he's high to pay. But if there is an us mm-hmm. then he would be Pater from paying. So if, if he is high in Misa Shemayim, he'd be Pater. However, according to Rava, who we just brought this Pasek, it's only Kares, right? My Kares, then you're Pater from the Shuman. But if you just had Misa B'day Shemayim, then you'd be high. Well, Abayi Pater. And would Abayi say, in the case of Zar Shach of a Shuma, that he's Pater from, from Tashlumen? So now we're going to get into this Lambas. Vamar Avchis, the Maidah Rabbi Nechunim Ben Hikina, B'goyne B'chalvol Shel Chavero. The Akhla, one who goes out, he steals the chalib of his friend and he eats it. Shulchayev, he is chayev for payment. So chalib is aser. He's aser. Uh, so a person eats chalib, right? He's chayev kares, right? He stole, he stole, stole. And he stole it. So even though it's two big punishments, nevertheless, you are chayev for both. So what do you mean? So let's see. Begani bechalav shalchavim ve'achal shul chayiv shekfar nis chayiv begneva kaidem shabala de yisur chayiv. Right? Because the person goes and he steals it, and a minute later eats it, so it's not the same time. Right? He's uh, alma the meina the agbe kanye mischayiv and asha. So what do you see here? When he picks up in his hand, that's when he acquires it. When he puts it in his mouth, ten seconds later, that's when he's chayiv. Uh, that's when he's chayiv kares. That's his chayiv chayiv. So. Uh, and, and so to in our case, when a czar eats, right, his, the Kohen's truma, so why is he potter in the case of czar shach of a truma? Because first he picks it up, he's high for payment mm-hmm. from the Kohen, right, for taking his uh, truma, and then he eats it, then he's high for eating it. What's so it should be the same thing. What? What's the question for eating it? So he's uh, over there, but we just learned what? No, but that's not based. The base is that this is Hashem, huh? No, no. So that, that's what we're just learning about. Even the person's high kares, even though his kares is not based and doesn't prosecute or, or, or plot the kares, 
if the Kareis and or the Misa B'nai Shemayim, depending on which Shita, occurred the same time as the liability of the payment, you're putter from the payment. So we're saying over here, that was the example when you're putter from the payment. But you're not, because first you steal from the Kareim, and then you eat his truma. So what happens? Somebody else puts a good right, good friend, a chavir, right? Someone else puts the uh, the truma in his mouth, so he doesn't go ahead and steal it when he swallows it, right? He's chayiv for stealing it, right. and he's chayiv for eating it. So right. that's the case where he's butter. Is this from so, the coin? From the coin. So it says so soft. Kevan deliase kani. I understand. Once he chews it, he's chayiv, right? Kani. Then he's kind of he's chayiv actually. I've had the blow. Until he, so when he's chewing it, he's chai for gneva. When he swallows it, he's chai for, uh, for for eating it. So when he has a to talk about his base hamlia, right? The guy doesn't just put it in his mouth. He shoves it all the way down his throat. So basically, the moment that he acquires it, he also swallows it. Oh so yeah, he's choking him. Ah, yeah. All right, yeah. So kigon, let's see. So what's the I'm sorry. So hey, kigon, what's the case? Eat the matzila dure. If the guy is able to go and he shoves it in his mouth, in his throat, and he's able to spit it out, so the other, right? So then he's, he's obligated to spit it out. If he doesn't, right, then, uh, you know, then it's like he, he's keeping his mouth. He acquires it first before he swallows it. And Eloi Matzi, I'll do it if he can't spit it out. Why well, should he be high for it? He, he was an oinus. So like, he could have basically, with difficulty, be, be able to spit out. So since he didn't do it, so he's not potter from eating, from swallowing it, mm-hmm. but he is high at the same time that he swallows it, that's when he also uh, considers to be stealing it from his from the from the Kohen. And therefore, according to Abaye, he would be putter because he's Chayim, Misa Shemaim, simultaneously as the Mama Paint. And Rapapa Mark, he's going to talk about the Mashkin, Shaltrumal, the Sechpi, for he put his liquid in his mouth, which isn't, uh, you know, which, which, which isn't spit out, right? Once it's in his mouth, it can't be uh, spit out. Ravashi Amar, Bizar, Shaachal, Truma, Mishalo. We're talking about the, the Zar, right? It was his own truma, right? Zar is Shaakha, but truma and Mishalo. The Kara, and the same time that he ate truma, he, he didn't steal the truma. He's not talking about the, the, the money for that, right? That was his own truma, right? It was separated as truma. He didn't give it to the, the Kohen or whatever it was. He owned it at that time. The Kara, Shirav Shachamir, and he tore someone's shirt at the same time. So the same moment he tore the shirt, he also swallowed the truma. Right then, we say he is part of the payment according to buy. Fine, top of the page. This is actually uh, Saturday's. This is Shabbos's now. But very good. Kufa, Amar Rav Chizda, Ma'ida. We're going to hopefully get to the middle of Amar Beis. So Kufa, Amar Rav Chizda, Ma'ida. Rav Chuni, Rav Ben Hikin, Rav Begani, the Chavos Shachamir, the Afu Shuchayim. So Rav Chizda says, Rav Chuni is, is uh, uh, agrees in a case of one steals the chelav of his friend and eats at the same time. It's chayim. Why should find his chayim to never call him shiyav the day of chelav? Because he's chai for Geneva first, and Obama later, then he's chai for the Chalib when he eats it. Now, Lema Pligi Rabiyab. Let's say it's Machos Rabiyab. What does he say? Dama Rabiyab in Hazarek Chaitz Metchilas Arba Lasayf Arba. One who goes ahead and he shoots an arrow in Roshus Arabim mm-hmm. on Shabbos. The Kara Shirin Abeli Chaso. And then while the arrow is going, it tears, it damages someone's clothing. Putter. He is Potter. She Akira Tsarachanachi. Because the Akira, now normally for one to be Chai by Shabbos, right? You need Akira and Hanacha. You need to go ahead and you know, to, to be Mavir something, Dalaram, which is a rabbi. One is Chai, right? Uh, it's considered to be Chil Shabbos to, uh, to carry something for Amos, which is a rabbi. So in order to, if I'm just walking through, that doesn't necessarily count. You need an Akira, you need to move an object, you have to pick it up, you have to Akira it. Right, re- uprooted from its current place, and then you have to move it, and then you have to place it down. So there's that kira and hanacha. So this all process, the the uprooting of it, is the same zman, right? It, it, is the tzarich hanacha? It's all together. It's one motion, right? So therefore, the arrow when he shoots the arrow, so the kira and the nacha is all together. Shakira tzarich hanachi. Mitchias arba soifar. No, he he throws it. Four hours. Yeah. Yeah, no, right. Throws hours, right? At the beginning of four hours to the end of four hours, right? So he says, so Hachanami, 
Why do we say that the lifting up of the chaylev is the tzarech achila, and therefore it shall come all simultaneously, and therefore he should be potter? But you don't say it's chayim, so it must be arguing, right? So it must be arguing the Rabbi Avin. So he says, well, hachi hashda, well, there's some differences there. Hasam yafshar l'anachab le'akira, right? Over there, right, it's impossible to go ahead and to, to, to place something down without, for the arrow to hit its target or to land, mm-hmm. Without shooting the arrow, you need to shoot it. However, over here it is possible to go ahead and eat without lifting it up. The boy, you can go ahead and you know bend down and take a bite, right? So he didn't have to lift it up, but to, to, for a, for an arrow to hit his target, it has to be shot. Inami or boy Over there, the picking up is not considered to be one motion because I can go ahead and pick up something up and not eat it. I can stop midway. However, right, uh, the over in the case of the arrow, once it's it, 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 the akira happens, the anacha is going to happen, right? But over here, once you pick it up, it doesn't necessarily mean that it's going to go in your mouth. You can stop. So my yika ben high lishna lishna. So once again, we've seen this a couple times right in this parak. When you have two different terutz, and what is the naf in between whether the person go ahead and stop midway? Or that you need to go ahead and have the refer, the, the, the the original Akira. One who goes ahead and he's walking with a knife, which is a rabbi, and he causes damage that way. Over there, in order to be high for that enough, you need the Akira, so therefore you need him walking with the with the knife. However, the Hachlishin da Marta Le Matzim Hadar, according to the Lashon, it says that you can't, once it's, you know, once you did the Kira, it can't stop until the end. Lo, Hachamatzim Hadar, over here you are able to go ahead and stop in the middle, so therefore that would be a Nafkamina uh, in between the two theories. Fine. Gufa, now going. What do you. Right, be, be, because you uprooted. From the ground, let's say, and then you did the hanacha in the boat. In other words, that was like one action, and then the next action is going to be once it leaves. No, that's no, that's the akira. That, that's the uprooting it. Uh, uh, it's leaving its place, right? I care. It's the uproot. No, because you're, you're right, but you know, for picking it to the ground and then putting it in my bow, that's an akira hanacha right there. Right, but we're actually soon going to see that each step possibly could be its own Akira and Hanukkah at the same time. So, well, yeah, what you're saying is sort of related to that. Let's see. So, Gufa, once again, now let's bring it. Let's go. We're going down the rabbit hole. We keep bringing up this case we brought. So, Amar Rabbi Avin Hazari Chetz Mitchilas Arba the Soif Arba the Kara Shirin the Halichaso one who goes and shoots an arrow right that it goes uh, four amos and it, and it causes damage from his clothing. Potter Shakira Tzarech Hanachi. Because the kira is tzarich anachi, so meisiv rabbi vibar abaye. So what about this case? As we kasha had gain of kis b'shabes, one who goes ahead, he goes into his friend's house, he steals his wallet. All right, uh, whatever it is, muksa, uh, not muksa. We, we don't care about the muksa right now. Had gain of kis b'shabes, chayev is chayev for paying him. Now he's taking the the item from the house out from a shusa yachid. Into Rosh Hashanah. Okay, once again, you don't need Dalai Ramos there, but taking it from one Rosh Hashanah, one domain to the other, makes one a uh, chayv in such a case. So we say there, when he picks it up in the house, he's chayv for stealing. When he walks it out of the house, and then later, he's chayv uh, for, uh, for, for, it's a Shabbos, for it's up. Yes, yeah, he's kind of there. He's kind of there. Now, however, then the next case, if he drags it and he goes out, he's potter. Why? Because dragging it is not a form of, uh, of Kenyan. At least not until he leaves the Rishon. Right. So, but however, so normally, just lifting up something, a smaller item, that's how you acquire it. But, or bring it to your, uh, bring it out of the rishus. So therefore, in this case, he doesn't acquire it by picking it up. But since he drags it outside, once he removes it from the house, he's acquiring it, and simultaneously, 
he's moving his item from Rishis Ayachet to Rishis Arabim. So the Amai, Hakanami, Leima Hagbalat Tzarech Ha'otzai. Why is he Chai in the first case? Say when he picked it up to go ahead and take it outside, it was Hagbalat with Tzarech, right, to take it outside. So it says, Hakanami, Skira, Kigayin, Shek, Bia, Almanas, Latzmir. When he picked it up in order to go ahead and hide it, he picked it up without intending to go ahead and take it outside. Right, put it on the shelf. Then he left off. Let's see. Then he forgot about it. Then he took it out or guys original intentions. Where says Vichai Gavin and Vichai? Does he have such a case? For Amar Rav Simon Amar Rabbi Yami Amar Rabbi Yechan. Ha Mifane Chavatim is ever the Zavis. So one of the guys is moving items from one corner to the other. Then he left off. Then he left off. And then he decides, you know, I'm not going to the corner room. I can take it outside. But see, a potter, he's potter. Why? Because when he originally picked it up, he didn't do the akira in order to take it outside. He did the akira to, to, to leave it in the house. So therefore, there was not an akira hanacha to be chayv. So, so like him, I'm an asshole. You know, okay, fine. So it wasn't mean that he didn't pick it up originally to steal it, to leave it in the house, and he was a chayv to took it outside. Right? Rather to take outside. And Hachabai Eskinak Sha'amar, he paused, he stopped, he picked it up. So why isn't it considered to be one process of picking up and taking outside one long process like the arrow? Because Sha'amar, he, he stopped. So he says, wait, I'm a Lamai. Why, why did he, uh, why, 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 you know, why did he stop? Either cause say, if it's basically, let's say it was a larger item, it's still like a box or like that. So that's the normal way. So therefore it's, it's one long motion. Right, rather he went to get it, a little, little bit of rest. About a case, it's my, but if it's going to go the case, it's my. But over here, it's only to stop to readjust it on the shoulder. Then what? You'd say he's putter, right? He putter for payment in such a case because it's all considered to be one process. So the Tony, I am a gutter of the right? Megar of the putter. So why in the safe instead of one case you pick up your chayiv and the case of dragging your putter? Say even make a more case. Say say benifa benisa benide. Say even when you're carrying it. Sometimes you're going to be chayiv, or sometimes you're going to be putter because it's all one motion, and sometimes you'll be chayiv. Why? What is that? Right? When he goes ahead, he stops in order to rest. Mm-hmm. Right? So then we'd say it's not all one motion, he's putter. Uh, 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 then you'd be chayiv in that case because then I was about the cause, but if you went ahead and readjust it, it's all one motion. Then he'd be uh, uh, putter from going ahead and paying because it all occurred at the same time. Sell her money, Ben Azay. Rather, it must be Ben Azay. The Amr Mahalech Ka'ime Dummy, right? One who is walking, it's like Ayme Dummy. Each time he stops, right? And knows when he's walking, it's like each motion is all different when he walks, right? About Zarek Mai, but if he threw it, then he'd be putter because then it all happens together. So, Venifli Venisa Medida, the Medra Murin Mahalech. Right when he's walking, then only then, right? Uh, uh, he chayv of al zorik. But if he goes ahead and, and, and throws it, putter. So the Gemara says no. Megar No, there's extra chiddush in the case of dragging, right? To teach us in the case that if he goes ahead and he drags it, right, then he would be uh, uh, then, then he would be putter in such a case. Why is that? Um, uh, what's that? You might think that the, the, he wouldn't acquire it at all. No, it's not the normal the, the normal derech to drag it, and therefore one wouldn't be chayiv even for Shabbos. Kamash Malon, that he is chayiv for it. So says, but my, what case are you talking about? Either rubber, if it's a large package, something very large, and you can't lift it up and you can only drag it. Or Chayhu, then he vada be Chayv and Shabbos. That's the derech to 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 move those things. Ella bezutre rather make a tiny thing. So lab Or Chayhu, he actually would be putter. So Ella b'mitzia, right b'mitzi, right an average item. Therefore, such a case, one would take it out. So the Gemara says, wait, now let's think about it. So he's 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 dragging it outside, right? Udafke lehecha. Now where is he taking it out to? Udafke l'shisarabim. If he's taking out to shisarabim, right? So is the Shabbos. So he is high for taking it from the house into uh, outside. However, is there Geneva Leka? There is no uh, uh, Geneva in such a case because he he never uh, he never acquired it, right? Wait, right? And Eid Afkelo Shusayachin. If he's taking it to his own Shus, so is there Geneva? But then there is an Isra of him acquiring it by dragging it into his house. 
However, it's a Shabbos lekar. There is no Isra Shabbos because what is that Chai Midaraisa from taking from one Rosh Hashanah to another Rosh Hashanah, right? That which we have, you know, uh, Erev, Wamad. So that's all has to do with the Rabbanan. But Midaraisa will not be Chai for Hotsan in such a case. So why says, no, it's Tzricha, the Afkin, the Tzidr, she's a rab. No, he brings it to, the, they used to have these posts and stuff in the side of a rab, which is, right, it was in the middle. Who commands? Well, he says, wait, see, there's a rabbin, the sides, or the side parts, there's a rabbin. So, what, what type? Or according to who? If according to Rabbi Yezer, well, that's the sides of Shisha Rabbin are just like Shisha Rabbin, dummy. So, he could, it's a Shabbos. When he drags that side, there isn't a Shabbos. Uh, uh, it's a Geneva Lacka, but there isn't no, a Geneva because he never dragged it into his own Rishus. He can't be coined outside unless he does Hagba. And he karabat is going to rabban. Damar sidi rishus rabim lav rishus rabim. They hold it's not the same status as rishus rabim. Is there geneva ika? Is there shabbos leka? Right? There is no is there shabbos there because it's it's not like rishus rabim. So the one says liyel and karaliyazim. The chiyam or liyazim sidi rishus rabim kushan dami dami. When does he say that? Sahani mili. That's only said where the inin chiyuba the shabbos. That's only when it comes to the chiyar shabbos. The dad chiyar rabim all the hasam. When people go there. And place things there. So therefore, when it comes to Shabbos, one would be chayim, aval in and mikna. But when it comes to like acquiring things, one wants to put it there to acquire it. Then we say it's not like a Rosh Hashanah. It's like a Rosh there. So he is coming. My timer, right? What's the reason? Why does he say that? Because he says the hal the hal right? The hal rabim. Because we say over there that it's not shchichi rabim. And finally, so Ravashi Amar Kigoyin Shetziraf Yado Lamata, right? When he goes ahead and he puts it, he drags it, but his hand is underneath it, Mishlaisha, right? It's close to the ground. The Kiblu, and then he, he plays in the other hand, and Kedarav, the Marava, Yodosh Adam Chashub, like Arbal Arbal. So therefore, a hand is considered like a muggle four by four, which one is required for a Hanacha. And therefore, he, if he drags it and he, into his other hand, so he does go ahead and acquire it. And it also is, would be Chai and Shabbos in both those circumstances at the same time when he's dragging it. And therefore, in such a case, he would be part of payment. And that's the scenario we're talking about. Oh. All right, we'll stop here. Shkayach said tomorrow. We look so we only have a little bit left. And then uh, we'll be off, I guess, until uh, Monday. All right, everyone have a wonderful day. Who is and- the last one?